Hey guys, what's up? It's Pete from Viewism back with another video tutorial. Earlier I had made a video on how to save Instagram pictures to your computer, but it seems like some of the methods in that video have been uh, sort of not um, up to par now because of some browser updates and Instagram updates. So I'm just going to show you a more modern alternative and some of the similar methods you can use to do that. If you haven't seen that video, it's fine. I'm just basically showing you how to save Instagram pictures to computer. So let's just jump right in. I'm just going to go ahead and go to Instagram.com. We'll go to Nike's Instagram as an example and just find a picture you like here we are we have a picture um, and if you click on it from their page it's gonna bring it in a hover box so you can just refresh it and that's gonna take you to the permalink which is the actual page where the picture is now once you're there you can right click and hit inspect element over the picture and earlier what the method had been was there was a, a background image option which would give you the source URL for the image but I guess they've updated that so all you can do is literally just as I said right click and try to find that image and as you can see here this div class right here that says private photo holder that's usually where the photo is and you can usually tell if you look because it says IGCDN dash photos and you see this big URL and there's JPEG at the end you can usually tell that the photo is probably going to be in one of these div classes so there's a couple of different div HTML classes here um, not to getting too technical but it's usually in one of these classes so you just gonna sort of have to play around with it uh, you can just hit this drop down menu and as you can see this little thing pops up and if you hover over this link you see that the image is actually stored in that file over there um, it's not too complicated but all you have to do is uh, right click on that URL and hit open link in new tab and that's gonna bring us to our source image once again which we can easily right click and hit save image as and maybe I'll save it to my desktop I'll name it Nike image and you know just to prove it to you guys um, boom it opens up uh, through Windows Photo Viewer and we have it saved to our computer so that's it guys that's enough for this video tutorial if you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you found it helpful give it a give it a comment subscribe Feel free to leave a comment below on what other video tutorials you would like to see anywhere from ranging to technology to reviews to tech tips to even developing things and, and, and editing and all different types of things. Just let me know what you guys want to see and we'll try to put it out. Hope you guys found this informative. Share it with your grandma, your dog, your auntie's sister's best friend's cousin. And that's enough for this. I'll see you guys in the next one.